guys are not going to believe who just left the EFF party. I mean, could this be because of Julius Malema? Well, we'll be talking about that in a couple of minutes. Well, if you're stopping for the very first time, you're so welcome to our channel. Please uh, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification button so you can be the first to get notified when we get to drop a new clip right in this particular channel. Well, we're going to ex be exploring a major political shift here in South Africa. We'll be talking about Kenny Motsamai and of course his departure from the economic freedom fighters and of course his recent move to the PA, that is a patriotic alliance. Well, uh, Kenny, who happens to be a notable activist and of course a former political prisoner, has voiced his reasons for leaving the EFF, citing bullying by newer EFF members. Well, we'll be breaking down the historical context and of course every other thing you need to know about this particular issue just down in the comment section. Well. To start with everything and to fully get the significance of Kenny Motsamai's decision, let's first look at his background and the role of the EFF in South Africa. Well, Motsamai happens to be a well-known figure in South African politics due to his activism and the recent or uh, exposure or the time he spent as a political prisoner. Well, his commitment to fighting for economic freedom made him a prominent member of the EFF, which happens to be a party known for its aggressive stance on economic redistribution and land reform. The EFF, which was actually founded in 2013 by Julius Malema and others, quickly became a powerful force in South African politics. The party advocates for radical economic policies, including the nationalization of mines and banks and the expropriation of land without compensation. Believe me, this approach has gathered significant support as well as internal conflicts. While Kenny Motsamai announced his departure from the EFF, citing bullying by newer members as the primary reason, while well, in his own words, he said something like, I have dedicated myself to the fighting for economic freedom, but the disrespect and bullying from younger members have become intolerable. Well, this was actually what he said during a press conference. Well, he did not name a specific individual but mentioned a culture of intimidation that he believes is undermining the party's mission. Well, this particular departure is a big blow to the EFF. Motsamai was not only a vocal member but also a symbol of the party's commitment to social justice. Well, his move to the Patriotic Alliance, which happens to be a smaller party led by Gates McKinsey, indicates potential shifts in South Africa's political dynamics. Well, the Patriotic Alliance, although smaller than the EFF, has been gaining momentum in various regions. The PA focuses on community issues such as local governance and crime reduction. Gaten, who happens to be the party's leader, welcomed Motsamai warmly, highlighting his dedication to social justice and extensive experience. While Gaten actually said, in his own words, Kenny possesses a profound understanding and a fervent dedication to the community. Well, this was exactly what Gaten said regarding uh, Motsamai's coming into the PA. Well, Motsamai's arrival could actually strengthen the PA's position and of course its influence, especially in areas where they are focusing on local governance. Well, Motsamai's shift from the EFF to the PA underscores ongoing political tensions and it is something that's very much common in political atmospheres like that in South Africa right now. While well, the generational divide within the EFF appears to be a significant issue, older members like Motsamai feel disrespected and bullied by younger members which could lead to further splits or weaken the party's cohesion. While well, the EFF responded to Motsamai's departure with a brief statement thanking him for his service and wishing him well. They did not address his allegations of bullying, instead focusing on their political goals. This response suggests the party may not be addressing the internal issues that led to Motsamai's exit. 
Well, I don't know about you guys, but would love to hear your thoughts on this particular issue. Do you think Motamai made the right decision by leaving the EFF? Again, what impact do you think his move will have on the patriotic alliance and South African politics? Please share your thoughts just down in the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe and do turn on the bell notification button so you can be the first to get notified when next we drop a new clip.